If you want to see more topics on electrical and electronics engineering related videos, then check the playlist section of this channel. In this video, we will see an example on impedance and admittance. Question Find current I in the circuit of figure when Vs of T is equal to 50 cos 200T volt. So here we have to find this current I in this circuit. Solution First of all, we will write what is given. So the value of voltage is given and we have to find the value of I. So first we will write I of T is equal to question mark and then the value of Vs is given. So let's copy this from here directly. Then the value of resistance, capacitance and inductance is given. So R is equal to 10 ohm. C is equal to 5 millifarad that is equal to 5 into 10 to the power minus 3 farad. Then the value of inductance is given. So L is equal to 20 milli Henry. So this will be 20 into 10 to the power minus 3 Henry. Now, first of all, let's see the Ohm's law for AC circuit. So it is, we have to find current I. So I of T is equal to, I of T is equal to, or we can directly write in phasor domain format. So I is equal to V divided by Z. So first we need to find the value of total impedance. So first we will find resistance impedance, impedance of resistance, impedance of resistor, let's say it is Z1, so it will be directly equal to R and R is equal to 10 ohm. Then the value for impedance for impedance of capacitor let's say it is z2 and it is equal to 1 upon j omega c j omega c now here we need the value of omega so here we can see if we compare this with standard equation v of t is equal to v of t is equal to vm cos omega t plus phi so therefore omega is equal to if we compare this with standard standard equation this is the standard equation so here we can see this cos 200 t so cos omega t that means omega is equal to 200 radian per second so here this will be 1 upon j into 200 into capacitance value is 5 into 10 to the power minus 3 5 into 10 to the power minus 3. So therefore Z2 is equal to if we solve this in calculator directly it will be 1 upon I into 200 into 5 into I into 200 into 5 into 10 to the power minus 3. So this is minus J minus j and since it is impedance so its unit will be ohm then impedance of first impedance of resistor impedance of capacitor now impedance of inductor so here we can write impedance of inductor let's say it is z3 so this will be j omega l so j into omega value is 200 into L value is inductance value is here we can see the value of inductance is 20 into 10 to the power minus 3. 20 into 10 to the power minus 3. So therefore z3 is equal to if we solve this in calculator it will be i into 200 into 20 into 10 to the power minus 3 it is 4j and since it is impedance so its unit will be ohm now we can easily find total impedance so total impedance is equal to 
z1 plus z2 plus z3 value of z1 is 10 10 ohm then plus the value of z2 is minus j so minus j then plus z3 value is 4j if we solve this in calculator so this will be 10 plus in bracket minus j plus 4 into j 10 plus minus j plus 4 j so it is 10 plus 3 j 10 plus 3 j and since it is impedance so its unit will be ohm this is the value of impedance z now here the value of voltage is given in time domain format so we will convert this into phasor domain form so v is equal to 50 at an angle 0 degree this is in phasor domain and this is in time domain now we know that i is equal to v upon z so voltage value is 50 at an angle 0 degree divided by impedance z value is this much so let's copy this from here so this is equal to we can directly solve this in calculator so 50 at an angle 0 divided by 10 plus 3 into j 50 at an angle 0 divided by 10 plus 3 j so it is this is in rectangular form we can convert this into polar form shift 2 then 3 so it is 4.789 4.789 at an angle minus 16.69 minus 16.69 degree and since it is current so its unit will be ampere now this is in phasor domain format i is equal to 4.789 at an angle minus 16.69 degree ampere we can convert this phasor domain into time domain so i of t is equal to i m cos omega t plus phi that means i of t is equal to i m value is 4.789 cos omega the value of omega is here we can see the value of omega is 200 radian per second so this will be 200 t plus phi value is 16 minus 16.69 16 degree and since it is current so its unit will be ampere so this is how we can find current Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to this channel and also check out the other videos on this channel and thanks for watching.